this ministry decided to kick the Bible into the congregation. Watch this. Yeah, let's just go with tails. Would you like to kick or receive the Bible? I will receive. Tom wins the toss, chooses to receive the Bible. Patterson back with the kick. Oh my goodness! Is that a touchback? Can you even get a touchback? First time in 18 years. And the name of this church is Crossroads. And according to reports, around 34,000 people attend this ministry. And notice, they applauded her after she kicked the Bible into the congregation. So what's next? I'm just waiting to see what they're going to make up. What are you going to do next to disrespect the Most High God? I'm just going to be honest. I'm scared to hang around certain people. I'm scared to go to certain churches because I fear God. I cannot sit and come into agreement with something like this. And I'm not saying I'm better than anyone else. But what I am saying is that you have to have respect for God. There has to be integrity for God. See, I realize God is a judge. I realize God is holy. I realize God is above all. I realize no one compares to his splendor. And to take his word and to kick it is blasphemous. These worldly leaders, they have a field day in the church. Because most people go to the building for entertainment. And now we're at the point where they kick in the Bible like it's a football. You know something is wrong. To see all these people come into agreement with sacrilege is alarming. It really demonstrates to us we're living in the end times. And Jesus said, in the end times, many false prophets shall arise. So in other words, many false churches shall arise. And they're going to be led by false teachers, false leaders. And they're not going to have any respect for God. The church is going to be just like this. These are buildings that they're raising up and they doing it their own way. They doing their own thing because as long as they do their own thing, people are not going to be offended. People are coming. People are being entertained. The money coming. And that's what it's all about. So guess what? These leaders are giving people what they want. We're going to kick the Bible. Notice thousands of people were there to celebrate it. Something is extremely wrong. Brothers and sisters, watch and pray. Be not deceived. This thing is going to get worse. We need watchmen. We need people who are leading. We need people who are not scared to expose this because it has spread it like a wildfire. There's no respect, no integrity, no honor for the word of God. As you can see, they call this having fun. My question is, what's next? Are you going to play basketball with the Bible? I'm sure you're going to slam dunk it or shoot a three-pointer with the Bible, and they're going to call that God as well. Brothers and sisters, watch and pray, and don't be deceived. God bless you.